Hello and welcome to Prusa i3 build tutorial part 9. Today we are going to show you how to prepare the glass plate for 3D printing. You can use a fevicol. You can put small amount of white fevicol on the glass of the heat bed. Then you can take some water and uh, you can dilute this fevicol so that it spreads evenly on the surface of the glass plate. You can do it either with your finger or a tweezer or anything else. Once this uh, glass, uh, this fevicol spreads evenly on the glass plate, it acts as a raft. And once the water dries, when you heat your glass plate, uh, only fevicol is left and it acts as a sort of raft uh, when you print with uh, PLA, so that the first layer sticks and uh, and it sticks really well to the surface of the glass. So there you can see that once you heat the glass plate to about 70 degrees, you can use either repetier host or protoface to interface with your printer from your computer. There you can see that the fevicol is uh, drying up and the water is drying up, sorry, and what is left is a uh, very thin layer of uh, fevicol which will act as a raft for the first layer of your object and once it dries up once the water dries up completely you can start printing and there you see that the first layer sticks really nicely and you don't have to bother about the adhesion problem of the uh, first layer you can also use a mixture of PLA and water instead of fevicol. Now the method to take out this part is also very simple. You don't have to do any, uh, you don't have to apply any force or you don't have to use any kind of tool to take this out. You simply have to take out the glass plate and uh, just put some cold water. You can also use cold water from fridge. So as the glass contracts, it automatically pops off the uh, object and it comes out really nicely. The surface finish is really cool. So this is all from 3D Printronics in this tutorial. We'll come back to you with some more tips and tricks on 3D printing. Keep watching this space for more uh, 3D printing tutorials. Thanks a lot and have a good day.